Sean, wonderful performance, fantastic result. I was here actually when Burnley beat Manchester United. Right, Robbie okay. Blake scored that goal. Uh, George Boyd's goal today, almost as good, and the result, every bit as good. Yeah, I mean, uh, you know, a fantastic result and a, and a big result. Um, we're in a run of very tough fixtures, which every man and his dog remind me of. Um, so to bring out that big result is, is important to the group. And it, you know, ensures that belief stays intact. I, I never question it with this group. I think they're very honest, and I think there's some quality. And we've spoken all the time, or I have, about the growth in the team, and and how they're learning at this level. And you know, you have to look through results sometimes and see the actual performance and who's doing what in their game. And I said all along, I think there's there's definitely belief, there's definitely a work ethic, but I think there's quality, and, and we're beginning to get a bit a bit brighter Premier League-wise, if you know what I mean, the, the nuances of the game and understand it better. And I thought some of that was on show tonight. Can I ask you, when you invest so much emotion, so much time and focus and everything working for each game, and then George Boyd scores that fantastic goal and you turn around and go and just sort of sit down on your dugout, are you not tempted to give it a Mourinho or a sprint down the touchline or something? I mean, you, you're admirably calm, you always are. To be honest, it's, it's more a mindset from when I was a player. I was, I was very similar as a player because there's a long way to go. You can't guarantee that that goal has, has done, the, done the work. So, you know, I've had, I've had games go with me, against me, and all the ups and downs as a player, as a coach and a manager. So I've, I've really focused on what needs to happen next. And, you know, it's just my way of working. It doesn't mean I'm not enjoying it, but it means I'm, I'm immediately thinking, right, what do we need to do now? And it's just the way I've always been. I was like it as a, as a player when I was captain insides, and I'm like it as a manager. Fantastic application from your team. Too. I mean, they never, ever stopped working, but there was a big shout at the end of the game. What was your view on the, on the possible penalty that obviously wasn't given, which is the important thing? Yeah, I haven't seen it back. As you can imagine, I've been, spent a bit of time with the players. But, no, I mean, if, we, if we've got one go our way, I think it's fair to say over recent weeks we haven't had everything our way and, and some big decisions gone against us, particularly penalties we, we, we should have had. Um, as every manager does, you just hope over a season they balance out. And if we've got one that's gone for us today, well... Fair enough. Um, Chelsea, City twice, Manchester United, you've had some outstanding results this season. Yeah, I mean, it's, uh, it's part of the mindset of the team. I, I think they play with freedom and belief, and, and that was on show today. And we're going to need that going forwards. I mean, make no mistake, we're not, we, we've never been naive. I'm certainly not. I know there's a challenge coming again next weekend and beyond that. Um, but this will surely, you know, we, we obviously understand. Does the wonders for the belief in the group and the, and the fans. Uh, they were terrific again today. I've asked them to be positive all season. They have been home and away. And uh, it's a reward for them as well.